ahead and start with you, Michael. Yeah, I have nothing to add. I thank everybody for their time today. Um, and as you mentioned, if anyone has any additional questions on anything I covered, I'm happy to take that conversation offline. Excellent. Thank you so much. And John, any final thoughts, nuggets to share with our attendees? Yeah, I think it's been emphasized already, but I'll do it one more time. And that is, um, if you're uh, if if you're representing a company um, as in-house counsel, perhaps as a credit manager. Um, and you receive a demand letter relating to preferences, um, don't ignore it, uh, because if you do, um, you know, the debtor if, uh, has already expressed an interest in pursuing the payment, and, and the next communication you may receive is a lawsuit. Um, and then it becomes a little bit more difficult um, to attempt to resolve because there's been an, an investment of time and money um, by the debtor. So uh, don't ignore these things. Um, let's, let's deal with them as they, as they occur. Um, I, uh, I, I do also uh, thank everybody for listening. I hope you've learned some things today and feel free to reach out at your convenience uh, if you have further questions.